Welcome to today's video guys. We are back in Dying Light 2 and today I am going to teach you guys how to upgrade your blueprints for free. Yes guys, you heard it correctly, for free. You're not going to need anything else. It's going to be totally free for you guys to upgrade and all you're going to need is a little bit of money but by now you should already know how to duplicate money. If you don't know, I have tons of videos on how to duplicate world money and that should help you guys be able to do this exploit glitch quickly, fast, and easy. Now, you're probably wondering, Laser, what's the point of upgrading the blueprints uh, if, you know, we have a lot of blueprints and it's a lot of money. There's wires, feathers, scraps, so many stuff that goes into the upgrade. How can I get everything gold? Well, today, I'm going to teach you guys how to do this for free. So if this sounds like something you guys are definitely interested, a like would be greatly appreciated because it does help us out with the other algorithm. Don't forget to subscribe so you guys won't miss dying like content. So let's go ahead and talk about exactly what we're doing. So, Whenever we're looking at the blueprints, guys, you're going to notice in order for you guys to get them fully maxed out to gold, you're going to need a lot of material. Like, for example, look at this one's almost maxed out, almost maxed out. But as you see right here, guys, it needs scrap, alcohol, battery. This one needs scrap, resin, uh, uh, pigments, and oxidizers. Now, when you get to the ones that are a little bit more complex is when it becomes more difficult because then you're going to have to get unique, uh, unique different sets of trophies scraps and alcohol this stuff is pretty easy but when it comes to the trophies those sort of things become a pain and even having all this look at guys having all this is a little bit of troublesome as well as you guys see i have zero batteries so you're gonna notice right there there are a lot of things that are missing in order for me to do this upgrade so how do you actually do this for free well the first thing i'm going to recommend guys is make sure you at least have enough money in your inventory because we're actually going to use money instead of using this to upgrade the item so let's see right here this one says I need military tech. I have two out of zero, so I have zero military tech. Um, this one says I need uh, military tech here, and it says I need infected trophies, infected trophies, infected trophies, and all that stuff. And as you guys see here, all of this is missing, right? I don't have enough money to actually upgrade this, or I don't have enough the all the materials to upgrade any of these, okay? Now, I could upgrade these right here, but I don't have anything. So what I'm going to show you guys is for the ones I don't have enough money to actually upgrade, which is probably this boomstick, which we'll be upgrading right now, is how do you actually do this? Well, you're going to go to the crafting parts, and within the crafting parts, you're going to look for single-digit ones. So basically, anything above a 1 would work. So, that, for example, this 3-1, this 3-1, this 1-1 one one wouldn't work, this one wouldn't work, this one wouldn't work, that this one would work, this one would work, and this one wouldn't work. So anything above 1... And that stays within the single digits. Of course, you're going to look for the number three. So when you go and buy here, you're going to notice that this screen pops up. It says cans, right? And it tells you you could buy these cans for six world currency money. Now, you're going to want to make sure you pay close attention to the background of the screen because this is very similar to an exploit that was found in, um, I believe it's in Borderlands, where you could do, you could kind of switch the screens and it would give you a different menu. So what you want to do is you want to make sure that when that menu pops up, you press bumper. And when that bumper gets pressed, you should look You should look that it shows up in this menu, okay? So I hope that makes sense. So you basically want to make sure that this menu, the cans menu, shows up within the upgrade menu, okay? So we're going to try to do it here. All right, guys, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to make sure you do the following. So let me show you guys exactly what you want to do. It is... If you want to upgrade whatever you want to upgrade, so let's say you want to upgrade the Molotov, you're going to leave your cursor or your circle around that weapon. So once you go to that, you're going to go to the crafting menu, and we're going to be upgrading the Molotov with just rags. So we're going to click buy, and when we click buy, and it's about to go ahead and go into the whole complete buy option where the menu pops up, you're going to press your left bumper. And what that's going to do is going to go back to the menu, and it should allow us to craft it. But as you see right there, I didn't do it right. So let's do it again. Let's go here. Still not right. All right. Still not right. Okay, so there we go. So as you see right there, guys, we actually got it to work that time around. It takes a little bit of practice, like I said. But right now, if I click buy... It's going to upgrade my Molotov, as you see right there. Molotov got upgraded with just a can. So we're going to do that one more time so you guys can see it here in real time. Once again, the timing is what's crucial here. 
We want to make sure we get it right. Okay. As you saw right there, guys, the Molotov got upgraded without a problem. So once again, whatever you want to upgrade, just put your cursor over it, and that will automatically upgrade the blueprint. So really fast, really easy to actually get this done. And you guys are going to have a blast because you're going to be able to upgrade everything. You're going to be able to upgrade your Night Runner tools, your accessories, your consumables, your weapon mods. Anything that you want to upgrade, you'll be able to upgrade. So if you want to upgrade this acid one, you're just going to have to make sure you hover over the one you want to upgrade. So let's say I want to upgrade this boomstick even more. I can keep upgrading. If I want to upgrade this regenerating booster, I can. Anything that I want to upgrade, it will allow me to upgrade. So if you're looking for something to upgrade your blueprints, this is by far the current fastest way to actually get this done. Now there is another method that I have coming out right uh, pretty soon that's going to help you upgrade almost everything uh, that you have really fast and really easily. And I have a new duplication glitch that's coming your way as well. So we have a ton of Dying Light 2 content coming your way. So I hope you guys are enjoying the content here. If you are doing the heat trade, guys, drop a comment, drop a like. But most importantly, subscribe to the channel, turn on all your notifications so you guys won't miss when our videos go live.